Hi guys! In today's video, we're going to talk about a really great plugin called Click Whale, which is a link shortener and click tracker for WordPress with many amazing features. So yeah, let's get started! So Click Whale is a link shortener and a click tracker for WordPress that will help you manage, shorten and analyze your links on WordPress website uh, very easily. And this is all while using your own domain. Uh, and ClickWheel has many different great features so like link manager, link pages, tracking codes, detailed statistics. So yeah, let's go ahead and check them out. Okay, uh, here we can see our links uh, like the title, the slug, target URL, categories, keywords linked, uh, how many clicks it got, so who created it. And we can also apply some bulk actions like editing, resetting clicks, deleting them. We just have to select the ones that we want and click apply. Let's add new. So here we can add our link title. Um, for example, let's choose click whale. And here we can add our slug and the target URL. And we can also add our direction type, whether we want it to be moved permanently or temporarily, um, etc. We can choose this one, for example. We can also click here to make it a nofollow link uh, and we can make it sponsored. Uh, we can also go ahead and add our description, for example, link shortener. Um, and here we have our keyword auto linker, which is only available in the pro version. Uh, this is a great feature because it helps you define the keywords that will be automatically linked to your posts and pages. Uh, here you can enable it and type in the keyword you want. Uh, for example, let's put link shortener and we can also add our link target. Uh, it can be default, blank self, uh, let's choose default and we can also add more and delete it whenever we want. Let's check out the UTM parameters as well. Uh, so this will help you uh, keep track of your uh, performance and uh, the traffics. You can add the UTM campaign, um, for example. Click whale promotion and you can also go ahead and add the uh, UTM medium the source, for example, video, and uh, the UTM term content. And when you're satisfied, you can go ahead and save the link. Just go back to your list and you will see it here. You can go ahead and edit uh, your links or delete them whenever you like. I also wanted to show you guys this feature right here you can go ahead and upload a link from csv files like you can download an example they provide you can choose your file here okay and then upload it a column mapping will appear so that you can check that everything is precise and then continue um, and the edit fields will appear you can edit them and delete them and when everything's, uh, everything is correct, you can go ahead and run the importer. Here we have our categories, um, like the title, the description, and links count, like how many links fall into this category. Uh, you can also add new. So here we can add the title of our categories. Um, let's type it in. like click whale links. Um, you can also go ahead and add your slug, uh, the description and save category. Go back to your list and you'll see it right here. Um, and let's head back to our links. Choose to edit it. And you will see your category appear right here. Uh, choose this one and save the link again. So now let's head uh, to our link pages and you can add new. Let's go to the settings first. Here we can add our link page title, for example, like click whale links. We can also add the description, the slug, uh, let's put this one and we can upload our page logo. Uh, let's choose this one. And we can also add the legals menu 
right here uh, and we can create our legals menu uh, we can also select the logo style uh, which is only available in the pro version uh, we can put the square which is the default one uh, or we can choose rounded circle watch just this one we can also add a logo shadow by clicking here let's check out our contents uh, here we have three uh, types of contents click with link custom link and custom content uh, let's choose this one uh, here we can select our links that have been attached uh, and the title the subtitle we can also choose the icon by uploading an image or selecting an icon or emoji for example let's select an emoji let's choose this one and here we have two post types so we can add a post or a page so uh, let's add a post we can select the post uh, where we want to display our links uh, for example let's choose this one and we can also customize the title the subtitle and the icon again for example let's select this one and here we have uh, our headings and separator we can go ahead and add them as well let's add our heading so uh, let's type in the heading we want for example the best link shortener and uh, you can also go ahead and add a description let's add our separator as well and in the pro version, you can uh, also go ahead and add blog post speed to social profiles and forms. For example, let's choose this one. And now let's head to our styles. Here we can customize our page text color, side background, etc. Right here, we can choose the page text color. And uh, in the pro version, uh, while customizing your background, you can also choose it to be like solid color or gradient. You can also add a pattern or an image. Uh, here you just have to upload your image and choose the position like this. Um, let's go ahead and choose this one, for example. And as you can see here, we have our demo version. Um, so we can check out the styles uh, and see which one we like before submitting it. And here we can set our link's background color and the text color. Here we can set the background color when it's in normal state and when it's in active state. The same goes for the text color when it's in normal state and when it's in active state. Uh, when you're not satisfied, you can always go ahead and reset the styles and choose them again. This also has SEO options um, and this is great. It will help you uh, boost your visibility in different search engines. Here you can add the title, the description and your robots meta and uh, this will allow you to choose how you want your links to be displayed in different search engines like no index, no follow, no archive, etc. And it has uh, open graph options as well. Um, this will help you like choose how you want your links to be displayed in different social media platforms. You can add the title, the description, uh, as well as an image, and you can preview it live. Okay, and the pro version also allows us to add uh, social profiles here, the email like Facebook or Instagram, YouTube, etc. For example, let's choose an Instagram link. Let's add this one and click save. Let's head back to our list and it will appear right here. Uh, you can also go ahead and view it like this. And let's head to our tracking codes. We can see the activity, the title, the description, position, who created it and when. Again, bulk actions. Okay, let's click add new. And here we can add our tracking code title. Um, for example, click whale code. Here we can insert our code and where we want to add this code. We can also choose the position right here. 
uh, we can also uh, choose where we want to insert this code like it can be the whole website or a specific page if it's the whole website we can exclude our link pages posts pages categories like this and if it's a specific page, we can include our link pages, posts, uh, pages, categories again by clicking here. Uh, we can also exclude some user roles so like administrator, author, etc. And we can add our description right here and enable our tracking code, then click save. Then go back to your list. And you'll see it right here. Uh, you can disable it and enable it whenever you like. So uh, the Pro version also has uh, this feature right here. Um, it's our statistics for our links, categories, link pages. So for the links, you can see like the clicks for today, uh, this week, this month, and you can see the link clicks overview, the most click links. Here the total links clicks, like the link URL and clicks. The same goes for categories, like the clicks for today, this week and this month. Um, forgot to mention that you can select the ones that you want to see specifically. Um, and in the links as well, here. Okay. Um, and you can see the category clicks overview, most click categories. And the total categories clicks, here the category, slug and clicks. And the same goes for link pages as well. Select them. And the views for today, this week, this month, uh, the link pages views overview, the most viewed link pages, total link pages views, here are the link pages and the views. I also wanted to show you guys some of its other tools. Like here we have the migration. This is great. Like if you have any data, um, from any other plugins that you want to transfer here, you can easily do that. Um, and you can also reset your plugin options, um, like restore default settings and delete all plugin data and reset all the statistics. I have already showed you how to import um, a link from CSV file and you can also export uh, uh, export a CSV file containing a list of all lists uh, like you can choose the column and you can also filter categories and go ahead and generate CSV. <clears throat> okay, so um, let me show you um, their pricing plans as well. Here uh, they have a demo version, which means that you can sign up with your email and they will send you the link with the login to your personal ClickWheel demo page and you can check out the features before purchasing. And here they have different pricing plans. It can be yearly or a lifetime. Let's view the yearly one first. Uh, here they have the personal user, experienced user, and power user plans. Um, this one like offers one side for $69 per year, excluding taxes, and uh, three sides for $129 per year, excluding taxes again, and 10 sides for $249 per year, excluding taxes. And for the lifetime one, here we have this one for $199, excluding taxes, and the three sides uh, for $399, excluding taxes, and the 10 sides for $699, excluding taxes. So yeah, uh, this is it. Uh, you can go ahead and check out the features and um, choose the one that suits you best. This is it. And that's how you can keep track of your links, categories, and link pages with the help of ClickWhale. Don't forget to give us thumbs up, hit that subscription button and bell button not to miss out on any upcoming content. Thanks for watching. Bye!